thank you. First thing is how to okay how to create a table using Notepad. Okay. Uh, here we will start by uh, talking a few things about table. Okay, tables it allows us to arrange data into rows and columns. They are commonly used to display tabular data like product listing, customer details, financial report, and so on. You can create a table using the table uh, where you say lesson and then you say table. Okay. Uh, now we are talking about the uh, the, the table in a, a in HTML. When we say table, uh, before we go into the code, the calling the full table, we have to first uh, calls HTML, right? And then we say head, and then we say uh, title. Remember, these are very important. Then you say my table, all right? Then you close title, then down here you'll put the body. Okay, then here after this one, let me remove it because and then I say it close body and then you say it HTML. Well, this is good. Uh, after this, after you uh, you put these things, this code in place, that's when you come to program the table. The first thing is that lays in table and then we close it. Sorry, uh, yeah, and then we say, um, we say tr table rows, remember, okay, and then we say th that is table, uh, horizontal, something like that, rows or columns or any anyway th and then we say it number then we have to close th then we go again th then we say it names then we close th and then after that we will put th and then we put h okay and then we put th we close it all right uh, now we finish with the horizontal uh, table. Uh, we are going to do uh, other things like we will close the full TR stuff. And then here we are going to program the next one. We say TR. And then we put TD. And then we say one and then you close TD all right so here we can simply copy this thing in three place because we have num number name and age okay because I don't want to take long time on this two and then we say it three then at the end we will close TR Okay, T R. So then we close the whole HTML tag. HTML tag. Sorry. I'm very sorry. We say table. Okay. That's it. Alright. So this is these are the code that we have. How to create uh, a table using our part. What you can do is that we say file and then you say served. Next thing we say all files and then we call it table dot html. Okay, and then we say served. Let's try to minimize this and then this is our table. Let's click it and we will see what is here. Uh, you can see that uh, we have this. Okay, number name and age and number is one name is two and age is equal to three uh, remember that uh, I just did made a little mistake right there okay this number two supposed to be a name 
So how do we change that? And how do we change three? Okay, let's go on and let's try to uh, make sure that we are putting something. Under number two, we say it John. And then number three is H, this one. So H we can put maybe 17, let's say like that. Then we can put another, let me save it and we refresh our web page. Yes, that is correct. Number is one, name is John, age is 17. So let's try to put another row again under this. How do we do that? First thing, we can simply go and put TR, the same way that we've been doing that, just to add the data on the system. And then we say it, number one, TD, and then we put two, because number one we already did, and then we close TD, then number two, TD, and then we put maybe Daniel, or let me simple, yeah, Daniel is okay, and then up to close TD, and then we put the H, TD, we close, and then we, we say it, maybe 20, we close the wool, TD stopped, and then there we are done. We can say it served. We can put as many as we want to, but simply, because we are simple, one, we want to learn this, uh, we can come here and say refresh. I just made a mistake. You see this thing? So where can we change this one? Okay, TD stop. Uh, TD and then TD, okay, then we do this TR, right? TR is there, and then TD, and then TD. Oh, we made a mistake. This dot. We put that particular thing so that the code will not be displayed. We are fresh. Yes, this is what we have. So, as you can see that this thing is very cool, isn't it? So, next thing we can do is that, why don't we put this thing in a table so that the table border will be shown. How can we do that? We come here, we go to our table. You can even say table, border, all right? And then we say it's equal to one. No need to put quote or any. And then we say served. Let's come back here. Refresh, yes. How is it? Is it cool? Yes, I believe it's cool. Well, thank you. Uh, this is how you can create your first uh, table in uh, notepad all right so HTML is very important so you make sure that you keep on moving moving learning all right thank you for uh, watching god bless you bye bye